Hey everybody, it's Gamalad. Welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons. In the last episode, we had our uh, Valentine's Day and gave flowers, to, flower sweets to almost every girl in town except for Elise because, well, she didn't seem to like us very much because we ignored her for a while. And, well, when you hardly leave your ritzy mansion, I don't have much of a reason to come talk to you. But to start the episode off, I thought we could go talk to her and... Oh, here we go. N Naughty's a landscaper. Okay. Hello, who are you? Okay, you should completely ignore us. That's fine by me. Phew, that should do it. Jeez, these were in, in a pretty bad shape. Hmm. Interesting feller. He's gonna stare at us? Hey, who are you? Oh, I'm Pat. I run the farm here, even though I haven't, haven't been around in months. So you're the farmer out like El like Elise, eh? Yep, that's me. Me? I'm Naughty. I'm a landscaper. Elise hired me to come come and take care of her of her garden, which is why come I've never seen you until now, though. Still, this place was in dire need of help. Whoever used to be be in charge here had no clue what they what they were doing. You can't be haphazard in taking care of of gar of a garden. Fixing up this place is gonna be take a lot more time than I, than I anticipated. I suppose I'll have to arrange an extended stay at the inn. Which means you're gonna be here forever. Hmm, well that's that was a waste of time. I've got a, I got too much work to do standing around here and chit chat. If you wanna talk, come back later. Alright. See ya. So, like I stated earlier, you're gonna be here forever and ever. Well, whatever. Let's talk to Elise. Let's actually talk to her a bit and, you know. Oh! Tasting vegetables. Did I bring her one? Oh, good day, Pat. Um, okay. Oh, she, she did want our vegetables. I have a, been expecting you, Well, Have you picked your finest vegetable to test against my refined palate? No, I haven't. I just came in to say hi. Can I back... Uh, 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 oh, 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 no. I don't have anything. I'm sorry. Wait, so you're... You, you, have you not brought a, a vegetable per our agreement? Oh, well, I'll continue to wait your best effort. Yes, um, no, if I gave you a potato with the quality I had for it, it would have been total crap. So yes, I completely forgot about that. You have to give at least different vegetables of good quality, I would like to hope. So we'll have to, um, do some better farming tactics, because my farming is kind of haphazard. I have really been playing this game very lazily, and not the way, like I played, um, Harvest Moon A New Beginning, where I was very strategic in how I got my plants to be in the best possible shape ever. But, um, yeah, so I'm gonna try my best to work around that and redo that. Oh, uh, I guess I should mention while I'm here, and I'm heading over to my plants and actually water them, because I, um, haven't watered them yet. Um, so, Story of Seasons. The last episode was about a month ago, and I'm fully aware of that. Um, I've gotten a lot of messages of people wanting to see the series, um, continue, and it is continuing. I've just been really caught up in Stella Glow lately. I just really <laughs> love the game so far. Um, the Let's Play was at, is, at, is what, now at 43 episodes, and I still probably still have another, like, 15 or so hours left in the game if my, um, information serves me correctly. So, I've been putting a lot of attention and effort into that game, um, I, which kind of puts this game a bit on the back burner. Uh, I will be trying my best, I'm up this a lot more often, um, I'm also gonna try making a discussion video of, oh, cool, props, I have to plant more now. Um... So I'm, I'm gonna make a discussion video of the new Story of Seasons game that was just announced a few days ago for, in Famitsu. Um, Story of Seasons, a friends, uh, friends of, of Three Towns, or whatever the name is. Um, I'll be discussing that in a bit of detail and giving my two cents on it and what it can mean for the future of the series in a way, because the information is quite, well, um, interesting. I don't know if, oh, my bag is full. Okay, next priority for me is to get a lot of money to upgrade my bag, which I may end up doing a lot of work off screen um, very soon. Uh, it's because, well, I'm kind of running low in the money department, and, um, well, it just seems like I need more money. So I'm going to try my best to um, plant more stuff and get more money. Alright, so now I can get, pick up some more of these turnips. And, um, yeah, because the lack of money has probably been hurting me a bit for not getting all the best stuff. And I think I'm just going to take more time to relax and play this game in my spare time so I can do some more stuff for the Let's Play. Um, granted, I'm in, I don't do it as much, but I feel like I'm going to trigger an important event and I'm going to have to abruptly stop playing wherever I'm at and have to, you know, drag the 3DS back home or wherever I'm at 
and record an episode so I don't you know miss anything important. But um, I'm gonna try my best to um, to improve in the future. So it's like I'm gonna buy some more turnip seeds. Um, okay, and this is the leafy crop field. Yeah, because I have to buy some leafy crops. I forgot if there's any spring leafy crops or not. But um, yeah, that's pretty much as best as I can say at this point. Um, in regards to the story of seasons, right now it's just like I think at this point in time I've cleared a hurdle where. Outside of maybe a few select things, it's just going to be the daily grind of, you know, going around, checking out my animals, checking out my crops, watering the plants, um, finding different ways to gather materials so I can up get better upgrades for my farm, and the standard, you know, Harvest Moon gameplay of, as of late. Um, I guess I should probably mention now that when the new Story of Seasons game does hit America, I will be for a fact, let's playing it in the same vein as I have been, are these early, they're done? Oh, they're done, and my bag is full, so I can't harvest them. Go figure. But, um, like I was saying, I will be Let's Playing it, hopefully, in the same vein as, um, this one. Again, hopefully it'll be a bit more active than this has been. Um, I do really do apologize for that, because this is, this is a really good game, and I have been letting down a lot of people by not uploading as much as I used to be. Uh, again, Stellar Glow took a bit priority, um... Because there's points in that game where I have to leave my 3DS on for several days at a time because I can't really save in a very big story-driven game like that in case something does happen with the recording. So I have to leave the 3DS on and I really can't like stop it's like, it's because I end the episode off like in the middle of a battle and I can't record next episode. So I can't really, you know, I guess I probably could have um, did a, um, a suspend save and come back to it. But I didn't want to, like, ruin the flow of my gameplay, like, coming back several hours later, realizing, well, crap, what did I just do, spend my entire time on? Um, let's go to the Safari Zone for now and, and see what... Actually, no, wait. Is there any, um, vendors in today? Because I need to start selling some of this junk in my backpack. Um, I need to buy a refrigerator, actually. That's the next thing I need to buy, or build, is a refrigerator. Start putting some of these vegetables in to, um, store them so they can stay fresh longer, and I'll be able to sell them in higher intervals. Uh, let's see, what's here today? Today is okay, the Silk Country is going to be there. So let's pay them a visit and see what they can give us. But, um, yeah, it's, oh, well, I also need to go back you know, to Town Hall and renew my permits because they, they went up for spot expiration. I am in no position for it to win a conquest right now. So before we do, let's do this, let's go to, the, um, let's call the horse and go to town. And we'll renew our permits first. And we'll get it, we'll assess, assess the situation on what we're looking at for the other permits that aren't are in our possession yet. I feel like we're gonna use the grass tactic and just harvest a bunch of grass to win conquests. I mean, it's a bit underhanded, but at the same time, it works and it's effective. Um, okay, let's see. Let's go to Rent the Public Field. Alright, let's go. Let's keep ours open. Yes. Alright, so let's see. Where, let's see. What other fields? What's the next big one that's gonna be open? The next one is gonna be. Uh, oh, in this one. <laughs> I need to redo that. Uh, it's basically the Spice Field. Okay. Really feels as much as you, Pat. Yes, I will. All right, so uh, I'm good. Okay, so we're going to have to um, start saving up some grass to um, to to contest the rice field, rice field, spice field, spice rice, same ice, I guess. <laughs> but um, yeah. So what else we need to talk about here? Because honestly, the more I think on it, I feel like the story of seasons gameplay videos. At this point, I'm just turning down into a bit of my where I just sit here and ramble for 15 to 20 minutes while you guys watch me play Story of Seasons in the background. Um, let's see, ship requested items. Do I have any requested items? Oh, ship out eggs and dairy. Recommended shipping. Oh, I can't hold the re wo Go figure. Okay, let's just, let's, um, let's ship some of this junk out of here. Ship items. Um, venue. Fresh turnips. Got a lot of those. Alright, fresh turnips all around. All right, potatoes aren't that fresh, and they're in the, let's, let's hang on the potatoes from now. Um, let's see here, milk, we're keying on to the milk. And now let's see if we can actually um, ship out our objects. Uh, wrong button. Um, we're going to ship requested items. Now, I, I, I am aware there are different rewards for, um, not, not, no space for rewards, cannot ship. Okay, wait a minute, I got this, I got this. Um, Nope, sorry, I meant to go for the, uh, select and ship. No space for reward, cannot ship, okay. Gee, okay, we'll just ship some more stuff that we don't need. Again, I need to start focusing on getting that backpack upgrade. The sooner the better, really. Okay, um, let's just sell this. I bought these, thinking so maybe I can give it to, um, someone else. But there was no need. Um, uh, I don't really care for the coffee. I'll just sell that. Um... 
I saw the walnuts, the plums, um, get rid of these weeds, I don't know why I have in my backpack, um, the dried soil, get rid of that. Alright, that should do it. And now let's see if we should be able to ship requested items. There we go. I got an item of gratitude, which is good. So the next one of those two right there. Um, let's see. Let's see if there's any more requested shipping things we can do um, this spring. Probably a, maybe just some spring crop ones. Let's see here. Uh, check recommended. Uh, accept quests. Request. Ship out spring crops. Okay, let's see. They want um, cabbage, cucumbers. This is for the um, cabin country. We'll take this request. Um, they want potatoes. I'll take that request. I forgot who wanted the potatoes, but um, the cucumber ones will also take again. I can't take any more. Okay, so that'll just that'll just do it for now. So I do know that the more we do, the more of these we do, the um, more things we can um, unlock. Um, were one of those vegetables yours? Actually, I didn't see the name of it. Um, nope, they were not. Okay, that's fine. Let's worry about getting more and more milk and eggs for you to for you to take. Um, let's see, what else can I talk about at this point in time? And this is, comes to another reason why I had a bit of an issue with Story of Seasons. I, I wanted to go to, like, you know, get to 100 episodes, show off everything I can, um, get, show off, you know, uh, Mary to a girl, whether it be a gate, it, it be Angela, or, um, uh, Lily, or whoever I'm starting to fall for in this game. It's just my lack of ability to commentate. Now, I know I'm commentating quite well, but I'm only at 11 minutes, and I feel like, in game-wise, I'm not accomplishing much of anything. And that's just been my issue with um, recording Story of Seasons. I can sit down and play and record for... I, I can talk over this game till the cows come home. This is a very relaxing game. I had a very stressful day at work, and playing this game just eases me up completely. And I can just, like, talk and ramble all the little mundane things that happen in the game around me. But I don't know if you guys want that. I would like some feedback on that. Um, again, I really do appreciate that, liking to know what do you want to see me do. Do you really just only want to see pure progression, as in, you know, show different character events, show different um, festivals and everything? Or do you just want to get me to continue on doing a day-to-day -day mundane grind? Okay, the Livestock Expo, that's coming up soon, so we'll probably get to that in a, in a later episode. Eh, maybe we'll, we'll, we'll conquer it in this episode. It just depends on what's going on here. Also, I, wanna, I haven't been able to trigger that tea time event. Um, I didn't pick up my cucumbers. But I watered my crops, right? I think I did. Okay, I, I'm pretty sure I did. I don't... I think... I, I know I did. If I didn't, well... Oh, well. Okay, a rainy day! So, if anybody, even if I didn't water my crops, I should be somewhat good to go. Um, but... Oh, the tea leaves are ready. Cool. I haven't... I don't know how to trigger the event where you give, um, tea to the, um, people. So, um, yeah. There's that. So, um... Hmm. I do know that I have two girls in town that already have a blue flower for me. That would be a gate in, in um, Ang in Angela. Um, the problem is, I just don't know if I, which one I really want to woo over. If I do over any of them, I may. There's also another girl in town I haven't unlocked yet. Um, that would be Licorice. Um, she comes later. I think she she comes this season. I don't remember exactly, but we haven't unlocked her yet. So I'm thinking I either want to unlock her and show show her first two events first. Um, again, I really want to show off all the flower events, but given the circumstances I'm under right now, is a bit interesting because I do own two copies of this game. I bought a re I bought a copy of it before before XC sent me a review copy. So I was able to um, have a second file, which I was able to use to, um, you know, set, make a girl profile, so I can show off some of the guy uh, flower events. However, I can't, tr I, can't I wanted to transfer my save data to the cartridge, but I was unable to do that. Now, if you guys know a way where I can do that um, easily, please, by all means, tell me. I will really appreciate that. That'll make my life a heck of a lot easier. Okay, I don't have anything here. These are just the tea plots, aren't they? <clears throat> yeah, they are. Okay. And, um... Yeah, that's pretty much about it. I think at this point, <clears throat> I may just have to cut ahead until we get to the um, Moo Festival. That's all I can pretty much show at this point. I don't have much of anything else I can show you besides me going to gifts people in town and random stuff and taking care of my animals. Um, so yeah, I will meet you guys back here in a second when we participate in the Moo Moo Festival, or whatever it's called. So I'll be right back in a second. Alright, and we're back on the eve of the Moo Moo Festival, whatever it's called, I forget. 
So we really were going to submit our best cow, Hanako. Yes, I even know me and her had a rough start at the beginning of the series. She's somewhat come around to me and I have a bit more confidence we can enter her into the into the Moo Moo Festival and not come in last place. Yeah. So now we're just going to be waiting around a bit. It's gonna be another minute or so before the festival does start. Uh, well, an hour in the game, a minute in our time. But um, yeah, so off stream I did a lot of um shopping around, uh, bought some more seeds, gave gifts to people, yada yada yada. And um, what I'm probably gonna do now is um, after I'm done with recording this, I'm probably gonna hop back in and recording some more Stella Glow. And then hopefully we're at, at a point where I can sit down and play some sort of seasons, you know, away from my computer and start, you know, like. Um, farming for materials, no pun intended, but get it first for us to get upgrades, um, get more money. The first thing I'm going to buy after this festival is over is a larger backpack. Um, I have over 100k, and I need to upgrade that backpack. I feel like in the long run, it's going to pay off, because the upgradable backpack is 100,000 gold. It'll it'll deplete my war chest quite a bit for our, our total town conquest, but I feel like in the long run, it'll come in handy quite well. Especially when we need to start hauling more stuff and more equipment around, and it'll just be a lot better off in the future. So, let's talk to, um, uh, Veronica, do you want to, uh, yes, we shall, let's play Expo. Um, who are we going to enter? We're going to enter Hanako. Even though she only has four hearts, she's a lot better off than when we first had her in this festival, so let's go and, and enter her. Exit, the festival will begin shortly, please wait just a moment. All right, maybe we won't come in last place. All right, and we got our wonderful host, G Goofy. <laughs> yup. Oh, great, we have, we have the two perfectionists. Welcome, everyone, to this year's Spring Livestock Festival, the Moo Moo Festival. Allow me to introduce this year's contestants. Entry number one, Margaret Farms Elise with Mary. What a weird-looking cow. Entry number two, Rosewood Farms Giorgio with Milky. Okay. Entry number three, Green Hills Farm Fritz with Itano. Okay. And it's weird the cow triplets, basically. Entry number four, Gamma Farms Pat with Hanako. Thank you, everyone. Your future bleeder does appreciate it. Now I have the honor of introducing our, our guest judge. The, the renowned animal tamer, Woofio. Hello there, everyone. <laughs> Yuck, I'm Woofio. And I'm doggone happy to be here. <laughs> I'm going to get doggone tired of making that voice because I'm going to have to speak for him. I mean, seriously, it's a very... I, okay, I'm not going to make any more dog puns. We will now begin the judging segment of the competition. Contestant, if you would please return to the waiting area, thank you. We have something to be everyone is from this town. Was there a conquest going on that I wasn't aware of? Well, I would have lost anyway, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so we have to say about this one. Oh, this one's good! No bones about it! Seems that one's a bit, um. Stint, um. Yeah, it seems a bit dirty. Mm, I see, I see. This one has a bit of fetching qualities. It seems dirty, though. Well, he seems happy to see you. Hmm, but you're not happy to see him. Hmm, I see. This one has fetching qualities, okay. And Hanukkah. Uh, well, oh, of course. Okay. So we know who won this one, at least. Ladies and gentlemen, it seems as judging has concluded, I will not announce the winners. In first place, and the winner is this Moo Moo Festival is it's Elise. Why are we even panning around? That's the only one that the guy liked. Yep, Margaret from Elise with Farm Elise with Mary. A round of applause, everyone. Woo! In second place is Greenwood Hill Farms Fritz. In third place, uh, r really, r really, even though we we, we 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 tried so hard, only to fail again. <sighs> well, there's a saying we have here in Cleveland. Wait till next year. Again, congratulations to our winners, Elise. That includes this year's Moomoo Festival. Yep. I'm sticking by the tried and true tradition of a Clevelander. Wait till next year. Because I think next year we'll have a chance of winning this one. Uh, okay, let's talk to you and get our boost with you. I, I bet the milk from the winning cow is super delicious, huh? I wonder what it tastes like. Now I want to try it. Oh, well, gee, thanks. Uh, let's see. Pat, be please be careful on your way home. Oh, that's really considerate of you. Thank you. What, are you- is someone gonna try killing me because I didn't win? <laughs> Unless someone actually it, it was betting on me, but with my current record of festivals, you'd be quite doggone foolish to bet on me. Oh, well. 
So I think that'll do it for today's episode of Story of Seasons. Next time on Let's Play Story of Seasons, hopefully I'll be coming back into a bit more of a, um, of a revamped um, inventory and t type of gameplay, because I'll be hopefully be having it done a lot more off-screen. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, check out the other parts in the series, and by all means, please, 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 down in the comment section below, leave me your opinions of how you want me to do the series in the future. Um, you want to see more of the, you know, the day-to-day -day grind of the Story of Seasons gameplay of me, you know, every day, going to the safari, watering my plants, giving my animals um, crops, giving gifts to everyone in town, or do you just want to see, you know, the heart, you know, the core stuff, the progression, I can try doing a mix of both if no one has any, if no one can decide what they want to see, but this will definitely help the series in the long run. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this series, I really do appreciate it, um, I do apologize for not uploading this in over a month, I've been so busy with Stella Glow, and I'm glad to come back to playing this game a little bit. So as always everyone, this is Gamma Lad signing off.